powers of decimal here we can discuss how to find out powers of decimal numbers so our first number is 1.2 whole square so for finding out we need to write fraction of this number so instead of 1.2 we can write 12 by 10 So this is enough to write. That is, in terms of out of ten, out of hundred, out of thousand, like that we need to write. So after point one decimal place there, uh, we need to write multiples of ten. If there is only one decimal place, we need to write only one zero. That is, we need to count the number of places, decimal places here. So here we can see only one decimal place. That is after point. We can see only one number. So that much zeros we need to write here. Actually, we are writing multiples of ten here. So here after point only one place is there. So we need to write only one zero. So here one point two whole square. So we need to write this whole square. That means. Square is for both twelve and also this ten. Then next step, we can split this. That is twelve square by ten square. Now, what is twelve square? Twelve square is one hundred forty-four divided by. If you need, you can write hundred or just ten square. So this is equal to. We know how to divide with this multiples of ten. That is, we need to put point here. Actually, there is an invisible point here. So, how much zeros are there? That much places we need to move to the left side. That is here. Two zeros are there. That is, ten square is hundred. Okay, so we need to move this point two places to left side. So the answer is one point four four. This is the final answer. Okay, so if we check here, we can see in the question we have only one decimal place. In the answer, we got two decimal place. So here in the question we have it's square. Okay, so One place la, one decimal place la number square je the gaye na po. Answer la endu ano two decimal places one. Okay, so nam kada direct write the idealo without writing this all steps. That is without decimal the number is twelve. Here we need to find out twelve square. Twelve square is One hundred forty-four. So, if there is one decimal place in the answer, square is another one. One decimal place double out. Okay, so we can rewrite this as one point two whole square is equal to. So here two places the number num. So the answer should be like this. अदायद राइट साइड में ना लेफ्ट साइड लोटे टू प्लेसेस ने की पॉइंट है सो दिस इज़ द फाइनल आंसर ओके सो ट्वेल्थ स्क्वायर के टिकाइन ना हम की इजी आई टा फाइनल आंसर लोटे था ओके सो व्हाट अबाउट द नेक्स्ट नंबर हियर पॉइंट वन टू होल स्क्वायर सो लाइक दिस वी कैन डू दैट इज़ ट्वेल्थ स्क्वायर इफ देर इज नो Here it is square. So twelve square is one hundred forty-four. Then point one two whole square. Here we have two decimal places. So if we square it, the answer in the answer it should be four. Okay. Two decimal places in a square jambol. Answer la four decimal places were. That is two into two four. So this is equal to 144. We need to write here. Then we need to 
move that decimal to left side to four places. So one, two, three, four. Put a pawn here, then zero. Okay, there is no other number. We need to put a zero, then point. So, so this is the final answer. What about 1.2 whole cube? So, without decimal, we can write that is 12 cube. So, 12 cube is 1728. So, what is 1.2 whole cube? Here we have one decimal place and it should be its cube. So, 1 into 3, 3. So, there must be 3 decimal places. So, here we can write the number here 1728 and we need to get 3 decimal placed number. So, here 1, 2, 3. Here point. So, this is the final answer. Clear. 1.1 whole cube so without decimal what's the number here that is 11 so 11 cube 1,131 then we can find out 1.1 whole cube so here we can see one decimal place in the answer there must be Ah, here we can see whole cube. There are places on the ah, place in the number into. If we power the number, we will final answer. In the answer. Okay, so here uh, we need to get three decimal places in the answer. So 1.1. 1. So what is 11 cube? 1331. There should be three decimal places. So here 1, 2, 3. Point. This is the final answer. What about this number? 0 0.02 whole raised to 5. So here we need to find 2 raised to 5. But a point will the number. Number is 2. So here 2 raised to 5. 2 raised to 5. 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2. 5 times if we multiply 2 we get 32 then in the answer we can see here two decimal places so number of decimal places that is 2 into the power that is 2 into 5 10 so in the answer there should be 10 places so we can write 0 0.02 whole raised to 5 this is equal to we need 10 decimal places here so, 10 decimal places are So, we need some space here. So, we can write 32 here. Here only 2 places. 2 digits we can see. So, 1, 2. Again, 8 more places we need to get. So, we can add 8 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Here... One point. So we need to write again one zero there. Okay. Point here the number. Zero would add an And we can read this number as point zero 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 three two. This is the final answer. Next we have point one whole raised to six. So without decimal place the number is 1 then 1 raised to 6 if we find any number of powers of 1 we get 1 itself. Then here we can see 1 decimal place and the power is 6. So 1 into 6 is 6. So 6 decimal places need to have in the answer. So point 0.1 whole raised to 6 is equal to we can write the answer here okay then 6 decimal places so here 1 place then 5 more zeros we need to write 1 2 
3, 4, 5. Point here. Okay, so this is the answer. See this one. 16 cube is given. And we can find out 1.6 whole cube easily with this one. So, 1.6 whole cube. 16 cube is already given the 4096. So, what is 1.6 whole cube? This is equal to here we have 1 decimal place and the power is 3. So, there should be 3 decimal places. That is, decimal place here is 1. 1 into 3 is 3. So, this is 4096. How can we write 3 decimal places? Move 3 places from the right side. 1, 2, 3. So, here the point. So, the Next one. 0 0.16 whole cube. How can we write? You can see here 2 decimal place. And the power is 3 itself. So, there must be 6 decimal places in the answer. 16 cube is already given there, 4096. So, we can write here 4096. Here we have 4 digits. Again, 2 more decimal places we need. So, we need to add this 0 here. That is 0 0.004096. Next one is 0 0.016 whole cube. Again, 16 cube is given there. So, we can check how many decimal places we need here. That is here 3 decimal places. 3 into 3 that is 9. So, there must be 9 decimal places in the answer. That is 16 cube is 4096. Uh, here we can see 4 digits there. Again 5 more zeros we need to add here. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Point and here 0. Okay, so this is the final answer.